Hi, I'm James, and in this video I'm taking a look at the beta of Dota 2 Reborn running on Intel HD 5500 graphics. This is in a Nook with a i3 processor. And first of all, the game defaulted to the native resolution for the screen, which was 1080p, and the lowest detail settings. Uh, so I gave the game a go, and it ran, as you'd hope, quite nicely at these settings, generally around the 60 frame per second mark. Um, which, you know, is good, but things look quite basic. So I decided to go back out and while keeping it at the 1080p settings, um, pull the graphical detail, detail up a little bit. So for Reborn, we have actually these nice sliders from sort of fastest to best looking. So I just took it up one notch. I didn't go into the advanced settings and start tweaking things manually. We've just gone with their automatic or their basic adjustment there. And you can see now the game looks a little bit nicer. The characters and so forth are a lot less blocky. As I think there was sort of some lower res rendering and then upscaling before. Um, but in this way, it looks good. Still seeing around 30 frames per second. Um, you could opt to lower resolution and increase detail settings if you want. One thing I would say, because the game defaults to the native resolution of the screen, if you have something like a Dell XPS 13 where you've got a... 3200 by 1800 panel um, or if you've got a laptop with a 4k screen or similar high-res panel you may want to manually adjust that resolution down otherwise the game may well struggle uh, high resolutions on this integrated graphics solution I hope you found this video useful be sure to check out the rest of the videos on our channel for more HD 5500 graphics uh, videos of games running and also for other Dota 2 content with different graphics solutions as well and if you want to stay in touch with what we do be sure to hit the subscribe button as well thanks for watching